Right, well, sort of proving that James Gunn may hate Henry Cavill randomly. DC Studios' James Gunn has now confirmed J.J. Abrams' black Superman movie still in the works. But it's an Elseworlds thing, so don't worry about that. It's just doing its own little thing in its own little corner of the universe. Why couldn't we get an Elseworlds Henry Cavill then? James, mate. What's going on? What's going on? Bizarre. Hit subscribe if you're new here, folks. Turn those bell notifications on. Uh, and please do check out the second channel linked down below in the description box. Mistake Reviews Live Archives. And do follow me over on Twitter at Mistake Reviews. Let's take a look. Uh, this is some AI rando image from this article. Um, but this is, so this is, for those that don't know, this is that movie that's long gestating side note i actually don't think this is ever going to get made but he has confirmed it's still in the works i don't think it's ever going to get made but this is the movie with tar nahisi coates behind it who's a notorious like an actual notorious racist has espoused actual racist rhetoric on twitter many many times like comparing white people to dogs and things like this like awful things awful awful things like if you were to swap out the word white for black you would be strung up Im immediately like really truly terrible terrible things um, but this, this is that this is that project, right? Bizarre, absolutely bizarre. So, yeah, strange. And, and also as well, it it wasn't going to be like it, it wasn't going to be the Black Superman because there are some, right? Which was rumored, or I think it was confirmed at one point. There was a Michael B. Jordan Black Superman movie in the works. Which is an actual character, a Superman variation from a different universe that is black. No, this was just going to be a race swapped Kal-El. That's what this was going to be. Just because reasons. So it's fine for Henry Cavill to be fired. But we can't bin the black Kal-El movie that would definitely confuse people. Because you're calling them exactly the same name and has exactly the same origin. Some weird shit. Anyway, it's so bizarre. So, look. Obviously, Warner Brothers, Henry Cavill, couldn't reach a deal over Superman's Shazam. So then you had a headless stunt double who was going to be wearing the suit. Well, he did wear the suit. And then Black Adam rolled round. And this was back when there was all that turmoil at DC. Power vacuum... Dwayne Johnson was trying to vie for power and influence and things like that, and trying to get the role of CEO. Uh, ultimately failed, but he did get Cavill to come back in that movie, which was cool. You know, got to you know, got to appreciate him for that, I guess. Um, and then he got to shoot a cameo role for the Flash, as well. But that was going to be a weird cameo anyway because he was going to be dead. Uh, as well. But anyway, that ended up cut, not happening because of DC Studios being formed. And then Henry Cavill got fired. Although, in the words of James Gunn, not fired. We just didn't renew his contract. Alright. So, before Henry Cavill was rehired, then fired, we had J.J. Abrams and writer ta Coates news dropped that they were going to be making a Superman movie with a black kal -El. That was the news. That was confirmed. And the whole thing was really, really odd. Again, obviously, everyone was like, yeah, of course, it's going to be a different thing, different reality, different universe. Story was rumoured to be a period piece, which explored the impact of a black Superman in America at the height of the civil rights movement, which, knowing ta Coates and the things he believes and talks about would have probably just been his bizarre almost like a like a a race revenge fantasy fetish thing that's genuinely what i think it would have been like it would have just wrote this black superman like he walks into a bar and then some guy is racist to him or something like that and then he would have like ripped his head off because this th this is what tarnahisi coats Lives like he's just bizarre and strange and he's an awful person. Anyway, so Threads came around um, and yeah, James Gunn answered a question about that movie. 
And James Gunn replied that yes, the movie is still in the works. What? So yes, that film is still in the works. Yes, it's still in development. Until presumably it gets a fish. I, I don't think it is going to get. I don't think it's going to happen. I think it will officially get cancelled. But who knows? Uh, he didn't elaborate on what that meant. But it does line up with things he said last year. So he said Superman Legacy and Abram Superman movie are totally unrelated. He said last year. That's an exciting movie. No, it's not. I know that Shantao Nong, who is the executive on that project, is extremely excited about it. So if it comes in and it's great, and I haven't, which I haven't read the script, and if the timing is right, that could absolutely happen. That's totally unrelated. It would be Elseworlds tale, like the Joker. So what? So you do everything that people don't want. And then you shit can the things that a fair amount of people want. Most people can agree Henry Cavill is a great Superman. Why can we just get one movie with him being an Elseworld Superman somewhere? So bizarre. So it appears that DC Studios will have the final say, of course. Um, I don't really understand. I mean, this. I don't think this is going to happen. I don't know why he's saying this, but he, he talks a good talk. Um... You know, Abrams has said he's not going to be directing the movie. Can't begin to express how excited we are for the project. Yep, more race grifting, I guess. We got to be excited for that. So strange. But this is the other thing. So that came following reports that Warner Brothers execs had decided his being at the helm would be in bad taste, probably because he's white. This whole thing's just bizarre. But you know, sure. Black Superman is still ready to go, I guess. Black kal Because reasons. Because every, everyone wants it, guys. Everyone really wants it. Of course they do. <laughs> anyway, I still don't think this is going to happen. But it does go to show that DC is a mess. Like, you, you shit can the things people want. And then you're leaving in... I mean, they're, they're spending money on this. Right? This is money. In development of things which people don't want. People are not interested in. I don't think, aside from like all five people, there was anyone else that was excited for this. No one cares. This is not going to be a seller. we just put people off. And it adds way more confusion than just Henry Cavill being in a movie. Bizarre. Anyway, what do you guys think? Let me know down below. Cheers, guys. Take care. Bye-bye now.